So before you actually watch this video, I just wanted to add in this little clip right at the beginning as I think it's quite important. Obviously, if you have got um, a not so good relationship with food, if calorie counting sort of triggers you, um, please don't watch this video. I have a lot of other videos that you'll probably enjoy a lot more than this one. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to put a little trigger slash disclaimer out there. Um, this is also just a little bit of light heart light hearted fun so yeah don't take it seriously obviously i don't do this every single day i've never ever done this before actually um but yeah other than that if you are watching for the right reasons then i hope you enjoy this video hi everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing well and if you're new and you've just come across this video then i really hope you enjoy it and if you do please remember to subscribe it would really mean a lot because we're nearly at 400 subscribers which i'm so excited about so for today's video i'm going to be doing the 10,000 calorie food challenge basically if you've never heard of it you need to eat 10,000 calories in one day which i think is ridiculous like i just it's a lot of food ain't it really i've got a lot of snacks like a lot of chocolate um donuts or loads of that and i don't really like that stuff it makes me a bit sick flapjacks you name it i've got it mini rolls I haven't eaten mini rolls in years they remind me of my nan and granddad so it is literally 9 20 a.m which means it is breakfast i'm gonna be making five hash browns which is a lot beans and a bagel um i added it up roughly i think that adds up to 800 calories but i'll work it out exactly like when i've got the food in front of me um i don't know how many five hash browns that's a lot of food but yeah, I'm going to go and make the breakfast. I'm going to go back home now. I've basically bought all the food. Go back home, cook the breakfast, show you the breakfast, add up the calories, show you how much I've eaten of it. And yeah, we'll just continue like that throughout the day. Okay, breakfast is made. I'm just looking at it. I'm like, what the hell am I actually doing? Why am I doing this video? Let me show you breakfast because the amount of hash brown is actually a little bit worrying. Okay, this is breakfast. I ended up going with toast because there was a little bit more calories in there. I've got beans, I've got five hash browns, and this totaled up to, with the butter, it was 900 calories. So if you ask me, that is quite impressive for a breakfast. So yeah, I'm going to go and eat this now. So I'm still eating. I've got... Let me show you what I've got. I'm really proud of myself because I actually don't feel like, oh, I feel like I could eat another five hash browns, to be honest. So, I've only got one slice of toast left and two hash browns. When I finish this, because I will finish this, I'll be back to show you. I did it. Guys, that got really hard at the end. I'm there giving it the big one, like, oh, I could eat another five hash browns. But I did it. Let me show you. Okay, I know I did leave some crusts, I know, I know, but like, you've got to give it to me. I've flipping eaten five hash browns and beans and two slices of toast. I feel so bloated now. Okay, so I'm just going to go and let that digest for like an hour or two. And then I'll be back for the next meal. I think the next meal is going to be pancakes with loads of chocolate spread because that will have lots of calories in but i can't even think about that right now because i actually feel sick i'm actually not hungry yet but it is 11 30 i don't even think it's been an hour since i had breakfast but i thought that i'd have a donut these have 225 calories per donut mm, these from sainsbury's Mm. so i've eaten one well basically eaten one i'm gonna try and eat another two which will be like 775 calories which means i've basically eaten 2000 calories already which is nuts that's why i'd basically eat all day and i've eaten it before lunchtime but yeah i'll be back after i finished eating this i massively underestimated eating 10,000 calories like how sick it makes you feel like I literally feel so sick it's now oh, I think it's like one thirty, so it's time to have lunch I'm supposed to be having a big stuffed crust pizza I feel like I'll pop I've eaten three donuts like you know those chocolate ones I showed you I've eaten three of those 
I've eaten like that big breakfast and now I literally feel like I need to go to sleep. Okay, so I ended up making oh my god, like look at this even making people sick. And this is like my favourite treat. Three pancakes covered like the inside of these pancakes are literally smothered in I can't even open it because it feels sick. They're caked in chocolate spread. Um and I think all together roughly it works out to be about seven hundred calories. So I'm going to eat this and then I'll be back if I haven't gone into a food coma. Don't ask me how, but I did it. I ate all the pancakes. But let me tell you, honeys, I can't eat any more now. Like, I've been defeated. I think it's like three o'clock. So I'm definitely not going to eat now for like another. Oh, I could even feel the pancakes like coming up with all that chocolate spread. I'm not going to be eating that for about another hour and a half or two hours because this needs to go right down. Pardon me. I feel really awful. Why am I doing this? I don't understand why I've done this to myself. There's so many other videos I could have done and I've picked to do this. But yeah, I'm going to let the food digest. We're currently on 2,400 calories, which I actually think is pretty good i mean it's only three o'clock i'm saying that it's not really good is it because i'm well away from ten thousand. <sighs> oh god guys i can't even think i can't think i'll be back in a minute when i can think properly so i never ever have napped i never ever fall asleep during the day like i'm always quite active guys i've just had a two hour nap because all this food has slumped me Anyways, I'm waking up, well, I've woken up and I've now realised it's like 5 a.m. and I need to get a move on because I still need to eat 7,400 calories, which is quite clear it's not going to happen now. I'm not going to be able to do that. Well, I doubt it. But I am going to go and put my pizza in the oven, which I think is like 1,000 calories, like 900 to 1,000. But let's go and see. It's a stuffed crust one. Um, yeah, let's go and see. Right, this is the pizza, and I've just checked the calories, and it says half a pizza is 659. So, obviously, I'm going to go for try and eat the whole pizza, which will be about 1,300 calories, which is great. So, I'm going to put this in the oven. Once it's cooked, I will be back. I swear that after today, like tomorrow, I am just going to be... Well, I always... This is what I mean. Like, I've not had any fruit or anything today or vegetables, which is not like me. And I'm really thirsty. Like, all this food is making me so thirsty because it's all sugary stuff. I just don't know how people eat all these sweets and chocolates and stuff. And obviously, you probably don't eat as much as this, but I know that there, there are people that would get through eating all this stuff. Like, how do you not feel, like, so... <sighs> after it do you know what i mean i don't, I don't want to see another donut again okay so pizza is cooked so i'm just about to eat it honestly i'm looking at it and i'm like Ugh. like i don't even want any more food like I, I could happily be done now but i actually put mayonnaise on it um which had 97 more calories on which is bad because i'm not really eating the calories um i put my nose on my pizza don't judge me and the reason is my friend gable gable fortune this he taught me this when we was like nine hour we was drunk on a night out and he put mayonnaise on his pizza and i was like what are you doing and he was like try it and i did and i was like that's a game changer and i've just done it ever since it's absolutely banging okay especially if you've got pepperoni in your pizza do it and comment below comment down below if you already do it because if you do then we can be friends let me show you this pizza because it's absolutely overloaded with cheese look oh my god normally i'd be like oh yes and now i'm literally like ugh. but yeah i'm gonna eat this pizza somehow and then i will check in again Oh my god, I'm really suffering over it. Honestly, like I, I wouldn't advise anyone to do this challenge. I seriously wouldn't. I just feel like you'll end up feeling so ill. Like tomorrow, I'm literally dreading it. I'm probably gonna be up all night with like indigestion. Okay, the pizza has defeated me. Like I have one slice left, but I just can't. And also, not to mention like the crusts. So I'm going to have to deduct, like, I'm going to take off 200 calories um, from the 1,200 or something. 
because I just can't. But I have opened these flapjacks and they've got 59 calories per flapjack. I've eaten two. Um, I personally think I'm basically at the end of it now. I mean, I'm going to try. Like, I'm going to go on till like 10 o'clock. It is 8 o'clock now. But I don't think I'll get past 4,000 calories. But to be honest, even so, I'm bloody proud of that because that is a lot of food. Like, if you actually think about it, that is so much food. So, yeah, if I eat any more, I'll be checking in in a bit. How she's feeling is how I'm feeling. I've actually just, I'm going to go and have an ice pole because I feel like that will, like, soothe it. But I hope it will. Don't even, I'm not even going to eat enough calories because there's probably not even any calories in it. But I just need something to soothe my insides. Um, It was a space runner and it just had 44 calories in it. It actually made me feel a little bit better. It soothed my insides. Um, So, yeah, I'm literally just under 4,000 calories. I think I'm on, like, 3,800. So, I am going to try to get to 4,000 and then I'm probably going to have to call it a day because this is a little bit crazy i'm just eating for the sake of eating i'm on my third flapjack and they're literally small like look they're small but i feel sick come on come on look. oh my god i literally will not be able to eat tomorrow i'm gonna feel so sick all day right we're literally nearly at four thousand now guys Okay, so I was just about to give up and I was like, right, let's see, I'll come on, have a little bit more. <laughs> so I have bought two yogurts in, one strawberry, one cherry, one's 203 calories, the other's 206. So that is 409 calories. I'm going to eat both of them. And then I'm going to be over 4,000 calories. I'm going to be 4,100 and something, nearly 4,200. And then I want to push to 5,000, but I just don't think I can do it. But let's just, let's see. Guys, I can't eat another one. Like, these yogurts are actually thick. Like, I'm still struggling to eat the first one. There's no way I'm going to be able to eat another one. I just can't. Like, I cannot do this challenge. I'm not going to be able to do it. This is ridiculous. There's no way that I can eat... 10,000 calories like I my belly feels rock solid like if you literally got a pin it would pop I feel so sick this is actually awful like why did I do this there's so many other videos I could have done so I'm gonna finish this yogurt and then I'm not gonna eat the second one I'm really sorry and then I'm gonna fucking call it a day because I've had enough of this I've literally had enough of this literally eating it there's one more spoon left but it's got bits in it even talking about it, it's making me feel sick. You know when things have bits in it, like orange? Ugh, I can't drink it. And this... Ugh. Oh my god, I've got a really sensitive belly now. I don't think I can finish it. Because I'm going to have to stop here, you know, because I genuinely feel like I'm going to throw up now. I'm going to be up all night with heartburn because of this. Okay, I'm going to eat the last spoonful. Oh, pardon me. And then I'm literally calling it a day because... Nah, I can't do it. Towie's on in a minute. I don't even feel like watching it now. I don't feel shit. It's all gone. Voila! Hello, fucking Louie. Right, so I'm going to have one cheese slice because... It's got 58 calories in. It's literally nothing, but it's like it's gonna be taste like eating a tissue basically. <laughs> so I'm gonna eat that, and then I'm gonna add up the calories because I think I'm nearly at the end of it now. I used to always eat these when I was younger. Just one slice. Mm. Okay. Mm. Mm. Actually, makes me feel sick. You should actually make me feel sick. I just can't actually do this. It's not even nice anymore now. So I'm not hungry. It's just not enjoyable. Where's that from? I think it's Big Brother. Ugh. 
This is really not good. Go away with that pizza. Put it in here. Put it in here. <laughs> Got one size pizza left. Go away. <laughs> I already took off the calories for the pizza, by the way, I'm not cheating. I took off 200 calories. Just can't eat that because it's a little bit mad, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm so determined, like, just to get to 4,000 calories. I am 100 and 71 calories away from it. So if I eat three more of these, oh, I literally feel so sick. So there's 60 calories per one, six, four, yeah, so I need to have three to make 180 calories, which will mean I'd have achieved 4,000. And then I'm genuinely gonna have to stop because I literally feel like I'm gonna throw up. I can't. Oh. That's one. I just you can't eat the one. I literally love to throw up. I'm back with a mini roll. If I eat this mini roll, I'm gonna be at four thousand. I'm gonna be at four thousand or like five calories. So I need to eat this mini roll. <sighs> I highly wouldn't recommend people doing this. I really wouldn't recommend it. I literally had to even take off my leggings because. The elastic around the leggings is just making my belly hurt. This is so unhealthy. Like, oh my goodness me. <sighs> Here we go. Mm. Made a right mess. Oh my God, it's literally going everywhere. I actually need some water because I genuinely feel so fucking dehydrated. All these chocolates. Oh my good lord. Like, I just feel. Ugh. This is not okay. I literally feel like I'm gonna be sick. This is not right. Hey, I'm going down. I'm going down. I literally like to be bad to like this. How's it taking me like 10 minutes to eat a flipping chocolate roll? I've done it. Yay! Okay, so I have written down everything I've eaten today. So I'm going to just read it out to you. So breakfast was 900 calories. I then had three donuts, which was 700 calories. I had pancakes, which was 800 calories. Pizza, I, it was supposed to be 1,300, but I took off 200 calories. Um, flapjacks. At first I had two, so I wrote it down as 118. I had an ice lolly, which was 44 calories. I then had a yogurt, which was 203 calories. I then had a cheese slice, which was 58 calories. And I've just had another flapjack, which was 59 calories. And finally, the mini roll, which was 120 calories. Taking me to a total of 4,006 calories. Yeah, that's mad because I didn't even make it like halfway to 5,000. I just don't know how people can do it. I really don't. But hats off to you if you can because that is pretty amazing. Well done to you if you have. Comment down below if you've actually done this challenge before. Let me know what you ended up, how many calories you ended up consuming. I want to know. Probably did way better than me. Um, But yeah, please comment down below some other video ideas you'd like to see me do. And I hope you all enjoyed it. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, everyone.